I'm Anil Kumar. Here is another question on solving radical functions with square roots. The question here is square root of 2x plus 1 is equals to square root of 3x minus 3. To solve such a question, we need to square both sides. So if we square both sides, what do we get? Let me write down here. Square both sides. So when I square both sides, I'll get 2x plus 1 on the left side equals to 3x minus 3 on the right side. Now we can bring the variables and the constant terms together. 1 plus 3 equals to 3x minus 2x or 4 is equals to x. So x equals to 4 is our solution, right? We should always check the solution whenever we are working with square root functions. The idea is whenever you square both sides, you could incorporate error, right? Because negative square is also positive. That is the reason. So if I substitute 4 on the left side, so we'll check both left side and right side. If I write 4 for the left side, we get square root of uh, 2 times 4 plus 1, which is square root of 8 plus 1. Uh, which is equals to square root of 9 which is 3. And on the right side we have square root of 3 times 4 minus 3 which is 12 minus 3 or is equals to square root of 9 which is also 3. So that is correct. right? Both are equal and therefore we can write down that our answer or the solution is x equals to 4. I hope these steps make it very clear how to solve equations involving square root. Thank you and all the best.